Josh here. I wanted to show you my new uh, circle jig, but uh, let me show you how it works first. So there she is. Got a nice little disc cut out of there. Now what's my design? Pretty much just basic magnet from Harbor Freight. Put a welded a nut to the top of a short bolt. It just didn't, pretty much is all flush with the bottom of this thing. But I could easily, let me try to get my hands in here, screw this thing further out. And there's my pinhole right here. So my actually, on my pantograph, I actually have a, a pin or my stylus I've been calling it, that's the same diameter as a kerf of my plasma cutter. So pretty much whatever that does, it mimics over there, and that's the point of a pantograph. But I drilled the hole slightly oversized of the pin, that way it basically just nests in there and follows. But of course, this thing being 12 inches long, I can adjust this. Now each half turn is approximately a 32nd of an inch. For what I'm doing, that's more than accurate enough. So what I want to do is I want to set this for, let's say, uh, Let's go a six inch circle now. So obviously that's gonna be half that radio, you know, it's gonna be a three inch radius for a six inch circle. Now I marked the center of my nut, so it's actually, it's pretty obvious on where my uh, adjustment needs to be. Well, let's get this thing out. Now I want a six inch OD circle. So again, it all, all depends on my stylus and, and the curve. Let's get another half inch more. That's the only thing that I need to speed up now is to get this, uh, figure out how I can uh, adjust this quicker. And line it up on my sheet. Alright, dry run. Go for it. as simple as a gift of just a pivoting rod. So you guys get that. So I thought I was going to cut a 16 circle. Bingo. Six inch on the money. All right, give or take a hair. Maybe I'm a, looks like I'm a 30 second over. It's all right, so we got to adjust that hair. But again, it's pretty accurate for uh, just a straight shot. And this is the third time I've cut with this thing. So pretty much I've only cut those two circles. And I've been able to get a pretty accurate circle right here. You can see my piers, but that was that more or less that's it. Maybe a tiny wave, maybe I kind of shook it a little, but other than that, guys, thank you very much for watching.